Bonjour à tous, hi everyone, and welcome to Learn French with Vincent, and this is Unité 2, Leçon G. And in this lesson, we'll discover together le verbe faire, so the verb to do, okay? So faire, faire is uh, really useful because we tend to use it uh, quite much in French, okay? So it's, well, usually quite important to discover this verb at the right beginning. So le verbe faire, je fais. Je fais. Remember, final S not pronounced. Je fais. Tu fais. Same rule here, final S not pronounced. Tu fais. Il, masculin, and then elle, féminin, fait. Final T not pronounced. Il, elle, fait. So if we take one second, actually you can see that here, here. And here, you get the same phonetical form, so the same form that you will pronounce, okay? So you get je fais, tu fais, il fait, and then elle fait. It's the same, okay? Then, nous, so it's quite strange because French people tend to pronounce faisons, okay? So like here, this R-E is not pronounced like normally we should pronounce it like E, but then like E. Uh, Okay, nous faisons, nous faisons, okay, and then this one is a bit tricky, so you will have to remember that, and it's quite funny because many French people tend to make the mistake and tend to, to say vous faisiez, okay, uh, but then no, 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 <laughs> it's vous faites, vous faites, okay, so remember final S here is not pronounced and then this e uh, is not pronounced either so fait fait vous fait and il plural font final t not pronounced font font elle font okay so i will repeat the whole thing one more time je fais tu fais il fait elle fait nous faisons vous faites Ils font, elles font. Okay, so try to remember this one because it is, as I said, really useful and we use it a lot in French. Okay, it was leçon G, so you can find the leçon H uh, on YouTube and it's the following address here. And of course, you can find all the previous lessons there as well. Okay, and then more material can be found here at this website. Okay, have a great day. Bye bye.